Hey everybody, this is Sheets, and this is going to be the lineup build for the Sunday uh, three-match or three-game LOL slate. Um, this should be pretty, uh, very conducive to GPPs because you have three relatively close series, two virtual pickums, and the BLG match, which is only minus three forty. So, going to be a lot of things you could play here. Um, uh, unfortunately it's only 5,000 for first, but maybe that'll keep, uh, entries down, um, of some of the better players, I guess that makes sense on a Sunday. Uh, let, let everybody focus on the football while we, uh, try to figure this one out. Um, so as far as takes go, um, team liquid did a pretty nice job today, um, putting together big kill games and their wins. But I think that was more of a function of of Gam, uh, that of their style of play, um, just kind of forcing TL into that type of scenario. So I'm probably going to fade, for the most part, TL today. Um, this one could be interesting. The WBG, Weibo Gaming today, they were you know they did exactly what we wanted them to do, kind of nice boring three, three three-game series, and in the deciding one, they didn't score all that much. Um, maybe that maybe this game will be a little lower-owned as a result, um, whereas the TL series might be a little higher-owned as a result. Just a little bit of recency bias here. So I think what we're going to do is, if, if as long as the Sims kind of get us in the ball game here, I think playing the DKWBG series to, you know, to, to deliver is going to be pretty wise. And this G2 BLG series, I, I have no problem playing some G2 in this as well. Um, so what we're probably going to end up doing is just kind of full fading the fly, uh, the fly quest TL series. Um, and you know, just hoping that one doesn't blow up. And the good the good news is is we will um um well, the good news is the bad news. I mean, it's going to look like we're in good shape going into that one because we're probably not going to have any of it, and it's the last series on the board. But you know what you could do? Again, like if you have a real bunch of good lineups here between uh, after the first matches and you're afraid that the TL fly, fly quest match is going to go off, you you could bet this in the betting markets like an over, you know, over in kills or something like that. Um it's one of the benefits of 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 having these late game hammers and having the uh, the betting markets available to kind of hedge exposures if you want to fade it. Anyway, I already put the lineups in. Uh, the, excuse me, the projections in. And I ran some lineups and let's run the Sims here uh, against the Shock Blast and the the Triumphant Warrior and let's see what we'd get without making any adjustments. So, like, if it was going to give us all, like, the TL and FlyQuest, um, I'd be a little bit concerned. But if you look at it, it's the highest owned, but it's not as if they, they demand you to jam these in. And I kind of like these situations, you know, because, we're listen, we're not going to play, like, the top projected lineups as a result. But it's not as if these other ones are just that far off. You, you know, as, as you've seen from me, doing the Sims before for League of Legends, sometimes they just really just try to jam in the two favorites. And when when you don't get just the two favorites, you should be happy about that. Um, so let's see. Looks as though the Sims are operating a little bit slowly today. Please wait for the previous contest since before trying new Sims. Well, I mean, what we could do is just, again, not wait for the Sims and just kind of just X these stacks out. So stack exposure, we'll make them all four threes and just basically just do this. We'll go no TL, no fly quest, and boom. And then you have all of this. So then you do have BLG, but you do have some fly quest. You're kind of like with market, excuse me, G2, sort of with market. Um, and then you have, you know, a decent amount of both these WBG and fly quest, uh, excuse me, and, and Don Juan Kia. But I want to make sure that I have enough four man of those. Um, 
Yeah, I mean, you're getting 30% WBG, which is fine. But I think we probably want to get some more Don Juan Kia as well. So we could probably just go ahead and just manually up, upload, upgrade this to um, kind of market share and make this say 30%. Well, this is close enough, right? So let's, let's say 25% DK, 25% this, and then 40% BLG. Um, I think this makes sense. And we do have, well, you know, I sort of want to have some G2 also, but I'm more concerned about having the foreman of the DK and WBG because that's kind of like our key here. So I don't want to waste too many lineups on a, a foreman G2 stack, which I don't think is really the idea anyway. But I do want to get to more market exposure on G2 though. I mean, I only have it 7%. So if we make them 20 Let's even 29. Let's see what that looks like. Well, I have to rebuild everything. Is that the story? You know, I don't know why the Sims are rebelling on me. I'm just going to start all over. I, you know, I wonder why the Sims are yelling at me here. Where are lineups in? Actually, put our projections in. And build lineups. We don't need 5,000. I mean, we could make 1,000. That should be plenty. But and you know what? You want to make 1,500? We'll make 1,500. Almost done here. Sorry for the dead air here, but I really did want to rerun this because I would love to try to be able to run the Sims. But I'll tell you, Saber Sim has been pretty, uh, pretty annoying last couple of days with this type of thing is you try to run the sims and it just shades out for like a half an hour i'll submit a support ticket i suppose and we'll run the sims here and let's just see what what happens but it shouldn't have a problem we'll give it about 30 seconds and then we'll just kind of have to give up on running the Sims here, which is a little annoying. I guess while that's happening, let's again go to stack exposure. We just want all four threes on, on this type of slate. And then with team stacks, again, we'll, we'll get rid of the TLs. We'll get rid of the fly quests. Why is it unable to produce these? All right. Well, same thing. We're going to go four man stacks. We're going to play. Make sure we play a decent amount of 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 G uh, of G not G two of uh of DK, which is fine, and a decent amount of WBG. What do you say? Thirty of each? No, I'd say twenty five of each. I guess twenty five of each of the four man stacks, and it's not going to. They're gonna make me rerun these. Um, so twenty five percent DK, twenty five percent four man of WBG, and then will I be okay if I get another fifty percent? No, I think we have to make it thirty percent of these guys, and just just I want at least one. Give me one ten per one, like ten percent of the G twos. Okay, and then we'll rerun these, I guess. There's no other way to do this. 
with just say a thousand lineups. And then again, you know, you're, we're probably going to you know, almost definitely, not almost definitely, but it's likely that we're going to be in first place or at least competing for first place after the after our first two matches here. And then we're just going to have to hold on when the FlyQuest Team Liquid one starts. Yeah, something is going on with Saberson today. Just everything is super slow. When's the showdown site tomorrow? 945? Right, there we go. Um, so we're going to have 30% DK, 30% WBG, 25%. Okay, this, this all looks pretty good. And then with overall team stacks, mostly BLG, which is fine, but but the, the four mans, you know, having a lot of them come from DK and WBG makes a lot of sense to me. Let's just make sure there's no funny business in the captain. Um, yeah, I don't think I need support captains today. I, mean, I don't really, I don't really think I need top in the captain either. Yeah. When's the last time King did anything for me? Actually, the other day he was actually really good. You know, we're going to leave the few that we get of him. All right, so we are going to save these to the contests. Boom. And I believe that the, you know, the, the Triumphant Warrior should be good enough. Something like this. Save this one, the Triumphant Warrior. That's good. Unable to meet. I don't know. Yeah, so Saberson is messing with me, but but I still think that I got the exposures I want here. So the key is going to be we're going to be rooting for these first two matches to blow up and for the last match to just bust. Let's just make sure that we're getting exactly what I think we're getting. Yep. Uh, way, Ben, Lucid. Okay, this is all fine. And then let's just take a look at exposures, a few exposures, League of Legends. Yep, Light, Elk, BLG, you know, all these BLGs, and, and DK. Okay, we're in good shape. Okay, that's going to do it. It doesn't look particularly, you know, unique. But I'm just hoping that that the, the Team Liquid side and that match gets a little more ownership than maybe it should. And we're just going to get more combinations of these others. And uh, that's it. Good luck tomorrow.